Hello and welcome to the Friday edition of Beer Bros. Today, for our final Shark Week beer, we drink our final Shark Week beer. You know what he means. <laughs> so, for our final beer of the week, we've got, once again from Dogfish Head. What? But this is old school Dogfish Head. Is that why you're dusting it off? Because it's old school. Oh, jeez. A Dogfish Head. And we actually had, this was brought to us by Beer Bro Victor, in honor of Shark Week, as was the Bull Shark. Uh, and at first I thought this was one that we had last year, but no, this is a different one. Okay, and who's Victor? Victor's the other Beer Bro. All you right. need to watch this show, it's called Beer Bros. I've never heard of it. Is it a show? I thought you just wanted me to come over and drink. <laughs> In front of a camera. Yeah, I thought with we a were blinking just, red light. I thought it was just like pretend, like we we're playing like astronauts or something. <laughs> <laughs> Are people, people watch this. So this is a barley wine. <laughs> barley wine. ABV is fifteen. Is that right? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you really left the stunner for Friday, huh? IBU is eighty-five and fermented with dates and figs. And figs. It's good because I really need a date. And it pairs with blue cheese and honey. If you need a date, I can hook you up, man. I know some ladies. I'm not getting anywhere near ginger. You'd like her. She's a fun girl. So that's a nice golden color mm -hmm. with a kind of copper, I say color, a copper color with a tannish, almost coppery head. Mm -hmm. About half a year's worth of head. Not terribly effervescent. Let's go ahead and give it a smell. Boy, you can smell alcohol in there. Maybe 15%. Ooh wee. Yeah, it is 15% ABV. Thank it you, smells Victor. like alcohol. Well, obviously it smells like fucking <coughs> alcohol, but I mean it's smells... So we should be able to see some uh, legs on this if we can get past the phone. Do you see your legs, sir? Uh... Oh. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and give this beastie a taste. Thank you, thank you. Can't bite that bad. I put my pinky up because we were lacing earlier with her legs. Mm. That is very much alcohol. Very boozy taste that covers up the majority of the uh, barley wine flavor. Man, I mean it's not bad, but it I mean, any any beer with that much alcohol content tends to remind you of other things you've drank other beers with high alcohol content mm -hmm. most of which probably cost an eighth of what that costs it tastes like kind of like keystone ice ah keystone <laughs> ice <laughs> just kind of like that's what the first taste like brought me back there okay sorry dogfish head i like all of your beers but this okay. one oh this is a rough week man yeah, yeah very a rough rough week it is every shark week Jeez. So, of the three shark beers that we've had, the Romantic Chemistry IPA, the Bull Shark, and the Old School Barley Wine, which was your favorite shark beer of the week? All right, so I don't think any of them were particularly, like, awful. Oh, um, just good. To, to put my, put on a happy, put a happy face on the week. Um, I'm going to have to go with the Bull Shark. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. With the Texas testosterone filled deadly beer. Yes. I mean, okay. why wouldn't we? We are in Texas. Yeah. Well, yeah. haven't lost that so, bet yet. Look, I beat I beat the beat the shark to my beer every time. He wants it, but he can't have it. <laughs> so with that, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and join us next week for more beer. Until then, beer bros out. Hello and welcome to the Friday edition of Beer Bros here on Beer Week. Today, we conclude with our final shark beer. Wait a minute, isn't it always Beer Week? Did I say sh Beer Week? You should keep that one. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see.